British surgeons have developed a groundbreaking operation to cure the most common form of blindness. Experts say the procedure could become as routine as cataract surgery, giving hope to hundreds of thousands of people who fear losing their sight. Here's our health correspondent, Thomas Moore. Just millimetres across and as thin as cling film, this is the patch of eye cells that may well restore sight to the blind. The cells, grown in the lab, were transplanted for the first time last month into an anonymous woman with age-related macular degeneration. It'll be several weeks before it's known how much she can see. We choose people who've had sudden, profound vision loss and they have a chance of getting their vision back possibly to quite a good level based on our previous studies. So we're very excited to get to that stage and find out just sort of what, it, what sort of visual recovery we're seeing. Scientists at University College London took a single stem cell from an embryo and grew it in their lab. With the right nutrients, it formed a thin sheet of special support cells that are critical for vision and die in macular degeneration. Surgeons at Moorfields Eye Hospital then transplanted a patch of the cells, fixing it underneath the retina at the back of the woman's eye. It could one day be as straightforward as cataract surgery. We can actually build banks of cells, which means literally it would only take anywhere from you know, a matter of weeks to put them into, on the patches and put them into the patients. Around 600,000 patients in the UK have macular degeneration. Peter Seaman has lost almost all his vision, but the new cell transplant has given him hope that he will see his family again. See their faces, watch their expressions. Um, I've got three grandchildren live in America and a son and a daughter-in-law out there. I, I haven't seen them, the grandchildren, I haven't seen them ever. Ten patients will have the cell transplant as part of a medical trial. The Royal National Institute of Blind People said the study was small, but it hopes stem cells will prove a significant treatment for sight loss. Thomas Moore, Sky News.